In early May, the Idaho Parks and Rec Department announced Eagle Island would no longer allow dogs off leash because of some incidents between dog owners. But after listening to the public, they will try a new pilot program. We're hopeful uh, that people will be respectful of others and, and, and play nice because that's the way that the pilot can, can stay in effect. Dog owners can let their dogs off leash on 212 acres south of the main access road and on the dirt trails that weave through the park. As long as the dogs don't harass other dogs, people or wildlife. People asked us for a compromise uh, and we're willing to go there, but it's based on the, the dog owners doing their part and showing that they have control over their animals and are, and are able to, to keep them uh, out of mischief. Last week, a dog off leash attacked a goose in front of some grade schoolers who were at the park for an educational class. Well, we changed our proposal quite a bit. Um, and, and again, it, that's kind of the impetus for the pilot. People said, give us a chance to prove that we can rein the bad behavior in and, and be responsible as a, as a community. Uh, and challenge accepted. We, we want to work with folks and see if we can make this work as a, as a middle ground position. Um, knowing that we just we can't have incidents like that one we had last week with the, the dog getting the goose in front of a bunch of little kids. That, that's just not going to fly. So the future of having dogs off leash at Eagle Island hinges on responsible dog ownership. And other requirements include carrying a leash, a waste bag, cleaning up after Fido, and for trails also keeping dogs within 30 feet and knowing that they will come when called because there have been too many incidents. Dog on dog dog on people, people on people about dogs. But dog owners who showed up to voice their concerns and ideas gave people a second chance at making this work, including the equestrian riders who like to run their dogs with their horses. They were some of the folks that, that had some of the good ideas and brought them forward and, and we're hoping to implement that successfully in this pilot. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.